um, this would be a very unusual move for a president to pardon, as I mentioned, in some cases these are convicted war criminals. In other cases, they have yet to go to trial. Uh, Has this ever happened to your knowledge? Uh, I don't know. Definitely not in recent times. And and I think beyond the specifics of the individual cases, I think there's a really dangerous precedent here that's concerning most veterans I've spoken to, most active duty military. And and that's that this doesn't really respect the military. The military has a, a rule of law. The military has a uniform code of military justice. It has courts. It has judges. And and they find conclusions. And sometimes folks are convicted of war crimes. So for the president to come in, zoom in and and negate the judgment of a military court and the military justice system really erodes the very foundation of our military. It means the laws don't matter. It means that civilian control can come in and just wipe it away 